Hi crafty friends, how are you all today? I hope it's been a great weekend for you guys. I just felt like coming on for just a minute. I was just sitting here twiddling around. I wanted, um, I don't know if you guys remember the stamp set when I won the uh, prize, a, a giveaway prize from the treasured page. One of the items was this label stamp set. So I decided to play around and use it with some scraps. You guys might recognize these. This is some scraps from the bird paper that I used to make the card for Clarissa at Paper Confessions. And I was going to use these label stamps for these, but this is literally where they were cut at. So it's so close to their faces that the um, the top line would go across their little faces. So I just um, cut the little corners off of them and inked them up and left them how they were. And I think they're really cute actually. And then here is some of the other ones. And I just got out some of my scraps and use the label stamps. It was so much fun, quick and easy, and now I have some unique little labels to use in collages and everything that are unique. You know, nobody else will have it. So those are super cute. And then I thought I would share um, my little layout I made with my card from Lori at PewDiePie Designs is just so pretty. And then uh, my envelope and card from Corn over at Cornflower Crafts. Um, I put them in my little card book. But look, so I remembered when I was doing this that I had told you guys when I was uh, opening my stuff from Corn. I already had some items laying off to the side that were just some random items. I was like going through stuff, organizing stuff, and these were just some random little pieces that I didn't know where to put, and they were off on the side of my desk here. Well, then I had some of these items from Corn that she sent, and I had set them over there while I was doing the video, and they went on top of this little pile. And later, when I glanced over, I was like, oh my gosh. I feel like these items put together would make an amazing little um, ATC card. And I told you guys, kind of told you guys that and told you guys I would show you later. And I never did do it until now. So here is the card. All these random items ended up in a pile together. And when I looked over, I just immediately saw this in my mind and was like, yes. <laughs> So, um, it's a little Valentine's ATC, um, for Valentine's Day. I mean, isn't that perfect, this little couple? I don't even know where this couple came from. It had to have come in some happy mail at some point. And then, here in the upper corner, this background is a piece. You know, um... Corn sent me just some little ephemera pieces. And then there was this ribbon in the background there. And then down here, I don't know if you guys remember from my advent calendars, I got this little embossing folder and this was the little practice piece that I used to show you guys. And then here we have this real pretty vellum heart from Corn. And then here is the little um, dangle piece. Uh, what do you call it? A little dangle piece um, from corn. It's got some lace, some ribbon, and a little heart unlock key um, charm. So I mean, I just felt like somehow all these pieces ended up in a little pile together. And they came from all different places, but yet they work so amazing together. So I just thought that was super cute. And I'm going to keep this ATC in here with my other items from Corn, just because I just feel like it goes. It belongs here. And it is just perfect. It was just meant to be. <laughs> 
So that's that. And so I gotta tell you guys, I'm having, you know, a real blast um, learning to watercolor. And you guys will see, I have uh, another video coming up this Wednesday for Watercolor Wednesday. And um, I just was having some trouble. I needed some brushes that I didn't have. And you know how it is. You don't necessarily have to have it, but it would make life nicer if you did. And um, I'm not able to spend any money right now. But I just kept thinking about these brushes. They're not expensive at all. It was a nice little set of brushes that I really wanted. And I still actually have money from Christmas that I have sitting there, you know, waiting for something to come along that I really want that I don't have money for. So <laughs> I decided to get this um, set of brushes. So you're going to hear me talking about brushes on Wednesday. But no worries, I have now bought the little set of brushes using some of my Christmas money. Um, and I'm super excited. I can't wait for it to come so I can practice with these brushes and start to, you know, improve. But that's all I got today. I was just sitting here tooling around and I just felt like coming on with a quick video to talk to you guys. I hope you all are having a really amazing day. And I'll see you later. Bye.